production deal with Sean Garrett and yeah it's about to get real crazy about to turn it up take over the industry you already know what it is truthfully I mean it's been a you know a up and down kind of a cycle for me this whole music thing but I've been waiting for a very long time just to you know sign a deal so I can start working because you know you do it around your hometown so much and it's like you know you wait for that moment where you can actually do it on a grand scheme you know uh, level and now it's, you know, that this is time, I'm, I'm very ready. But I've been waiting for a very, very long time. Probably like eight, nine, when I first, first started singing in my room. I definitely feel as if, you know, there was many points and uh, peaks that I felt as if I wasn't gonna make it anywhere, truthfully. I mean, anybody that's human should feel that way. I mean, you work so hard and sometimes success doesn't always just, you know, gravitate towards you. You might not see, you know, uh, the growth or the progress in your own eyes. People might see it for you, but you don't see it yourself yet. And uh, I've been there a couple times, definitely a couple times. And uh, I don't know, it was it was very hard trying to see past it to, you know, I don't know, just uh, make it a better, you know, see the, gr the greener grass on the other side. But um, yeah, with this sign this production deal, there's gonna be a lot of pressure. But you know what? I feel as if um, from the beginning, I've been through boot camp. Uh, and I feel as if that has prepared me for this moment. And when you're yourself, you can't be wrong. When I met Sean Garrett, I was at my house. And it, I believe it was uh, three o'clock in the morning or something like that. Like, it was really early. And I was up, and I was waiting, anticipating, and he, you know, he showed up. And it was, it was already, I was already amazed because now it's like, he came to my house. He could have been anywhere in the world working with any major celebrity artist that, uh, you know, reports and things like that. But he came to, you know, use his time with me. So I already knew it was getting kind of serious, but when I met him, it, I don't know, I was kind of nervous. I had to, you know, sing for him and things like that, but I got over it and uh, yeah, it was, it was a great experience, truthfully. But I just felt that much more special knowing that he was at my house. Has the voice helped me? Um, yeah, the voice has helped me. It's made me a stronger individual, and uh, I feel like just being out there and like getting, to, like breathing that air and being on that stage and seeing the lights and you know all the behind the scenes stuff. It really made me a better artist. It put me out on, you know, took my wings off and like pushed me. You know, made me have to fly on my own. So I think uh, it's made me a hell of a lot stronger. To anybody that's out there that's working hard to you know reach a goal for anything not just music or not just the industry or whatever it is like when you get to that point where it feels as if you know nothing's gonna you know budge nothing's gonna move and you're not gonna taste that piece of success or whatever the case may be like really keep pushing so i truthfully never give up and i know that sounds really cliche but never give up